Hello, everyone, and welcome to DFA's quick tutorial on how to use the Hub Dialer. My name is Alejandro Chavez, and I'll be leading you in this. Before we get started, the Hub Dialer is a tool that allows us to call hundreds upon hundreds of more people, but more importantly, we actually speak to more actual voters and less time dialing and getting answering machines. The system removes answering machines and people that don't answer and just connects you with more live people. So when you're calling, be patient and remember to smile because voters can really hear that come through on the other end of the phone. Well, if you came through an email or whether you're on the democracyforamerica.com backslash DFA dialer link, you'll notice on the right side is where you'll log in to the hub dialer. If you came from the email, the information is already populated, just click log in. If you're signing in from the page, you'll want to complete the information like your name, your phone number, and so forth, and then click log in. If it's the first time you're calling, please make sure you use, check the little box that says first time using the hub dialer. When you're all ready, go ahead and click log in. Now you'll know you're in the right place because in front of you you'll have instructions on how to use the hub dialer. It's about two or three paragraphs. Just below it, you will see the script. I encourage you to read it two or three times and familiarize yourself with where everything is on the page. When you're ready, scroll to the bottom of the page and there's a button that says, let's get started. That will take you to another screen. Now on this screen, you will see a 646 phone number. You're going to call that number with the phone you're going to be making calls with. An automated voice will come on and ask you for an ID number. That number is underneath the phone number on your screen. Once you've entered that number, they will repeat back a confirmation code to you. And you'll enter the confirmation code on your screen. And then click the button that starts calls. Now this is an important process because it's connecting your cell phone, the computer, and the database to make sure that Everybody you call is the person that we're trying to reach. Uh, so once you click Let's Start Calls, you'll be taken to another screen. And now you're actually in the database. You'll know because you'll hear music. You'll see an orange flower on your screen that says, Please Wait. And that will continue until a voter is actually on the phone. And the way you'll know that somebody's jumped onto the phone is there'll be a, the music will stop, there'll be a beep, and the script will pop up in front of you. Now it's very important when, the, uh, when you hear the beep and the script pops up to go right into it. Uh, a lot of times the voter has already answered the phone and said hello, and so they're actually waiting for your response. So it may sound something like this. Beep, hello, my name is Alejandro. I'm calling uh, to speak with so forth, so forth, so forth. Uh, please do not pause when you hear the beep, or someone might think you're not there and hang up. Now, I did mention before that most answering machines are taken out, but not all. If one happens to get through, don't worry about it. Just click the button that says, this is an answering machine, at the top of the page, and you'll be put back in the queue to start receiving more calls. Now, when you've actually gotten a voter, and you've read through the whole script with them, and you've answered all the data accurately, and you're ready to end the call, after you say goodbye, do not hang up your phone. Let me repeat that. When you say goodbye, do not hang up your phone. You actually want to stay on and just click the button that says next call. Now if you do log out, it's not a problem. This does happen. Simply go back uh, to the original democracyforamerica.com backslash DFA dialer and repeat this process. Now, when you're done making calls after the two hours, uh, you can do two things. You can either hang up your phone and uh, close the browser, or you can click this is my last call. All the data is saved in real time, and as you go along, so there's nothing for you to do, it's all saved as you go along. Last, I'll encourage everyone to please stay on for as long as you can. These calls are crucial in helping turn out voters that might not have made out, turned out for the election, and a call from a person like you can be all the difference and influence to help them get out and vote. So thank you so much. Stay on for the full shift and have fun making calls. 
Thank you, and have a great time calling.